finally at this pond or canal or whatever it is and apparently the crocodiles are, are there as well and the girls are not even having it they don't even want to take any chances but we want to see the crocodiles crocodile 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 I know the reason why you haven't done this is because of fear. You're simply scared of being accepted. You're scared of whether people are going to judge you. embrace the music the way you embrace it. After all this talk, I feel that going when we get back to Lagos, first thing I'm going to do is find a voice training class and then just do something. On our way, we see like a lot of stuff. We see women, you know, literally just sitting down like as if they're in a Maybach. They have this face like, the donkey knows where we're going, so we don't need to stress. Hey, uh, yeah, that's, that's, my own, that's my own. Yeah. Hey, uh, it's See, your guy is a fighter. <laughs> don't know how I'm going to be able to survive this torture. Well, you eat chicken all the time because you're seeing this one you're about to kill does not really mean, it's not, doesn't make any difference. It's, Chicken. Chickens are different, they have feelings. Yeah. And they know. Like, he, like they, they have that feelings. The guy came inside, they Chickens that have feelings. I feel so bad. So um, we're back at the hotel and Ajifa has found the gym, which is, I don't know, it's, it's, everybody's excited because we like to work out. We have to stay fit. I mean, we've all been on a pretty tight schedule in Lagos. Richard, perfect routines. And he sent in some workouts for us to do because the girls tend to gate crash my workouts at the gym at home. Yeah, basically, I like to work out a good sweat. I like to work up a good sweat all the time. People on my Snapchat are always complaining that I'm always sweating on Snapchat because that's all I do. So I'm gonna go to bed because I'm exhausted. So good night. Wagadougou day three. I'm excited. <laughs> All right, so today we are going to go check out um, a studio right here in Wagadougou. Okay, so we are in, at Boom Media, mm -hmm. audio video and graphics. Mm -hmm. uh, it's called one of my super. I'm I was supposed to meet a very, you know, pretty much like the clients put us of this place. Uh, he's a director, he's a producer, he's a graphics guy, he does editing, he has a studio here. His name is Booby Cook. Yeah, I'm Booby. Booby Cook. First of all, he has the, one of the coolest names. Hey, shop by Booby Cook. Boobies. Booby Cook. Shaitan. Shaitan. I love Nigerian names. It's not like food, you know. <laughs> <laughs> you say, you like, oh, I love food. Oh, I love food. Oh, he says hi and he has this great energy and we hug and we say hi and he literally says our names sound like good food. Okay, so welcome to my place. Uh, this is Boom Media. It's a production house, oh. obviously. As soon as we walk in the door with Patrick and he introduces us to Booby, I understand why he's he's probably been able to achieve so much. He's such a great guy, so down to earth. I feel like I've known him for such a long time. And then we go into his office and it's like a nice editing booth type of thing. Two screens as is usually done. And then he's talking to us about the industry here, about he's shooting music videos, about how, what it's like to be a producer in this country. He showed us a music video by one of the biggest artists here. <laughs> I'm alive, I'm laying my name. 
I really like the song, and I'm not just saying this, I really like the song, the acoustic on the song is really nice. Even though I don't understand what they're saying, but it's a song about climate change. And you know, we just it's just, it's just a really easy conversation and this long talk about you know our careers. He wants to know what we do. Ajifa obviously talks about her production. I talk about my presenting. So we just, of course, plug in Red TV real quick, plug in the source real quick, make him watch the show, and he's he's quite impressed, you know. Another thing in Lagos, you know how they say you cannot you cannot survive in Lagos and have only one, one job. job. You have to do at least two. So it's even small. But they, they need to be related somehow. Yeah, yeah. So my other my other thing, which is like my bigger job, mm -hmm. but you know that I do most of the time. You know, the source we produce bi-weekly, mm -hmm. but even though we're doing stuff for the source throughout the week, it's not as, you know. Mm -hmm. So I am a production fixer. That's why I said I will collaborate with a lot of European. It's still your job. So, mm -hmm. so still, I'm trying to explain. Still, yeah. <laughs> so I'm trying to explain. That's what I'm saying. It still has to do with production. Yeah, yeah. But I'm a production fixer, but that takes a lot of my time. Okay, so that's, I don't that's energy new to, to me, do. production fixer, what is it? So if a production fixer is pretty much the person who makes international like if i'm, an, if I'm coming to burkina faso mm -hmm. i don't know anybody here mm -hmm. i reach out to you i know you're a producer i'm like mm -hmm. you know i'm trying to show a documentary on the shanties mm -hmm. now you're the one who's going to help me get the shanties you're mm -hmm. going to help me get my booking you're going to help me Basically, get everything drivers I need everything, that everything that i need for the production yeah, yeah. to happen yeah. the logistics so logistics yeah. everything booking. exactly so it's like a line and coordinated line, production yeah, yeah, yeah. so that's that's what i do so oh, that's great. a lot of documentaries from ireland from london from europe from um, from, from america I've done about five. Well, how, how is like Red TV? How do you find Red TV? I know it's, right. it's, is it new? Officially, Officially it's one, one year. year. But I think, you know, the, 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 the you planning know, and everything before had, before the probably be like two years. Yeah. Yeah. And it's because, and it, you know, it's, it's doing good, but you don't, Africans as a whole, we've not really tapped into that mm -hmm. internet, online, online, yeah, online platform, yeah, digital, yeah. you know, type of. Um, so you see, if you notice, you watch. I think it has more to do with our Inter data. Our data is yes. worse. In our internet is expensive. Yeah, because anytime you, someone takes a phone and like, are you on YouTube with my phone? Hey, please. <laughs> That's also what we try to do with episodes of the source. We try to keep them as short, short and as concise possible as possible. Because we so understand that people them. don't people want like to spend to their 50 yeah, years yeah. watching yeah. something online. So we keep it's it short. It's not I mean, I know people who download movies on, on their phones and they watch it. They can spend two hours on their phones. Yeah. It, as, long, as long as it's not consuming any data. Yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 The problem is the data. I mean, we are not with Bluetooth. It's too, it's too expensive. Yeah, mm -hmm. we understand. What do you think can be done about it? Well, when we get into power, we just handle all of that. Just wait, hold on. Okay. We're coming. Yeah, lady power. We're coming, we're coming. Don't worry, we'll change all of that. <laughs> That's how we free for everyone. After we showed him what you know the source looks like, he was like, Oh, it looks like my studio. So we decided to do like an episode of the source. And he decides to be a rapper <laughs> called Sledge. Picking up the paper, pen it down with anger. On my left chin up and down like a roller coaster. They say it. Hey. 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 And uh, Shaitan does like game time with him, a little small thing. So while uh, Ajifa oh, okay. is whispering swing her things into Sledge's ear, my name is Shaitan, reporting live from Burkina Faso. I know this is weird because we usually report live from Lagos, but this is our first edition here and I'm here with Mr. Sledge, okay, we're going to be playing mm -hmm. game time as soon as Ajifa lets him know what game it is we're playing. Okay, okay. people, you ready? Let's do this. You know, he, he's, been to, he's been to Lagos just once, but then we invite him over again now that we've formed a new friendship and a new relationship. You know, as producers, you never know, you know when you're getting to meet each other. So, yeah, we do a bit of freestyle. He's actually not, not, you know, not a bad rapper, and I don't blame him. He grew up with Sakode, for, you know, for God's sake. Yeah, Sakode is his friend. Yeah, I'm just putting it out there. Um. Uh, is, is this part of it? Is this part of it? Who dances? Flavor. Okay, guys, you can see Sledge is just one big ball yeah. of fun. He's, yeah. Thank you so much for coming on yeah. Game Time. Hopefully... Yeah, thank you, and I thank your producer for letting me do it. <laughs> oh, how could I forget? Before we go, you need yeah. to drop one or two lines. You know, like six bars. You know, you know it's, it's kind of difficult doing stuff like this on TV because, you know, you have other rappers out there trying to steal lines. Steal your lyrics. Yeah. Oh, right now, lyrics are very hard to come by. <laughs> 
listen to American music now. They don't say anything good. They That's go, never do like that. No, I don't do that. AJ found this really cool spot called Le Vadoyon. If you ever come out here, you need to go to this place. It is awesome. You walk in, the ambience is completely different. Literally, you know I've been asking where are the wealthy people around here? Do you think it's too early in the day to drink? Bro, if you're drinking, I'm drinking. <laughs> okay. Um, Jack Daniels. Jack Daniels. Yeah. And Coke. Uh, Coke. Um, can I get uh, double Malibu? Malibu, uh, and Sprite. Yeah. Thank you. Thank you. <sighs> so wait, are we waiting for the girl before we Yeah, order? I think we have to wait for them. Because... Take forever? Shayton is going to kill us if we don't wait for her. Uh, and actually, I've been crying about this. Yeah, they go to the production place, mm -hmm. I mean. Look, you wanted to go. Yeah, no, I wasn't interested. <laughs> Oh my god. It's a really cute spot. I really like the paintings on the wall. I like the colors. I like the owner and her husband are sort of painted on the wall as well. It's very cute. Thank you. Merci. To the good life. Better than the life I live. The biggest thing of all, guys, is they have Wi Fi. Amila? Huh? They have Wi Fi. Lie. They have Wi-Fi. Hi. Oh. Oh, oh, oh. It's like a joke. Um, Wi-Fi password? Ha <laughs> ha. Jesus Christ. This is a lie. Take this one too. I've died. Thank you. Stop oh. it. <laughs> they have Wi-Fi. Do you know how emotional this makes me feel? <laughs> I feel so emotional right now. Like that I'm gonna cry. Like <gasps> they have Wi-Fi here, as you say. So we head out to Lerber, New York, and as soon as we get there, I can already tell, I'm smelling the food from outside, I can already tell that I'm going to have fun in this place. But I just hold it to myself, I don't want to be too excited, so I don't jinx it. We walk in, and it's just, it's beautiful, it's, it's outside, you can see over on the left where the pizza is being made with fire, not oven pizza like they do in some places. You guys, perfect timing as well. Yeah. Perfect timing, perfect timing. Have you guys ordered already? No, no, no. We have a plan, I was sick of picture with us. Yes. Really? Yeah. No, for real, for real. No, 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 no way. Like, for real, for real. In yes. Are you sure? Yeah, she's over there. There's somebody here that wants to take a picture with us because she says she's a fan of the show. And I feel very, very happy about that. Patrick, <laughs> we, we need, need you. you. Together. We need you. We need you. Patrick! <laughs> Oh, she's just talking about the heat. Oh, yeah, yes, very, very hot. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Amel, 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 I think that's her name. She's very, she's very nice. I mean, she, she said it feels really good to touch us in person. I wanted to cry. I need to get myself together. So it's our last day in Wagadougou. We're leaving today. I can't wait. We're going to Abidjan today. So we're gonna go for a quick swim, take some pictures, because you know we have to tension the ground. The heat is quite insane. I've been sunburned from here. I can see tan lines everywhere on my body. We need to cool off before it's time to fly. Hey, nice, relaxing thing to do before we head out to the airport. Come in, people. Immerse yourself. That's no one. I'm not having this book from my <laughs> Now, myself and Amiola are not 
I don't want to say we're not great swimmers. We don't know how to, <laughs> we don't know how to swim. We've been saying we're going to swim for the longest time, but we've never gotten around to doing it. So we just decide amongst ourselves, since Ajifa and Tajay can swim, how about we pair up in teams and teach each other? Swimming is going really good. Evidently, Amiola and Shaitan cannot swim. I am a mean, I am a semi, I'm a, like I'm above the average Nigerian when it comes to swimming. So I can literally fl flow, move from the end of the pool to the other end. I can literally do like basic stuff. I can just, I cannot, as in I'll probably not drown in a river. Do you get? I can swim, but I'm not a fantastic fish like Taja is. See, that did not really work out because look, I'm still here and I don't know how to swim. So, yeah, I think I'll be taking classes another day. We're packing and then hopping on the plane. We're leaving the country, finally after the heat, after the stress, after all the issues we had in this country, even though I am too happy that I saw my uncle. It's time to pack. The reality is just hitting us that we're literally leaving this place. And I know that's weird, but I'm kind of gonna miss this place. Maybe, maybe, maybe the hotel. I'm kind of gonna miss this hotel because it's pretty, pretty nice. Everybody here is so nice to us, you know, caring for us and checking up on us and giving us the best of their service. No one's rude here. I'm tired of our little girl's time to leave, really. Like, this place, I keep saying it, it's dead. Now. <laughs> you don't know what you mean to me. Oh, Everybody just yeah. say one thing that they're, they're uh, cheering for. We're drinking to happiness. Good life. Not Except suffering. <laughs> so, uh, blah, blah, blah. Yeah. How do you Skype with your wife today? Huh? How do you Skype with your wife today? Involve the whole conversation about. Can't take that off. <laughs> Are you still rolling? Yeah. Oh, okay. <clears throat>